friends, today my mommy is making coconut candy. Yay! I like it because it is so, so nice. Please subscribe to my mommy's YouTube channel. Thank you, Kendra, for that intro. Guys, do you remember good old coconut candy? It is still very much around, but we don't see it as often as we used to in those primary school days. That is why I decided to take you down memory lane with me. I made these yummy coconut candies at home and the children were so, so delighted. Stay tuned. Let me take you through the few easy steps to make coconut candy at home. Let's get started. For this recipe, we will be using four medium-sized coconuts. So we break open the coconuts and then we proceed to take out the flesh. After that, we wash the coconuts thoroughly and then using a carrot grater, we proceed to grate our coconut into very tiny flakes. Just like this. So we keep grating till we are able to grate all the coconuts. And we are done grating. See how beautiful our coconut flakes are looking. So at this point, we set aside the coconut flakes and we proceed to the next step. Into a pot, we add in one cup of sugar. Then we add in two to three tablespoons of the coconut water. I mean the water that came out of the coconut. We give it a gentle stir and then we proceed to place the pot on the fire. So, we keep stirring on medium heat to caramelize the sugar or till the sugar turns brown. The sugar has started changing and once it becomes like this, we then come in with a teaspoon of grated nutmeg and half a teaspoon of salt you know salt is always good to balance up the sweetness so we stir everything to combine and then we come in with our coconut flakes nutmeg would help give a very nice flavor to our coconut candy so we keep stirring till all the coconut flakes are coated with the brown sugar You know, coconut contains water. So as you stir, the coconut flakes will begin to release their juices. So you continue stirring till all the liquid dries off. Because if you still have some liquid in there, you won't be able to mold it into balls. As you can see, the color is changing and it is becoming brown. So at this point, it is left for you to choose the color you want. The longer you stir, the browner it becomes. So I prefer this light brown color. If you want it a bit darker than this, then you continue stirring for some more time. So at this point, we take it off the heat and we place a parchment paper on a tray and we gently pour it out on the parchment paper. So we spread it out and let it cool down for about five to six minutes. So you let it cool down a bit such that you can be able to handle with your hands because if you let it cool down so much it will harden up and you won't be able 
to mold it. So we apply a bit of granite oil on the hand and then we gently mold. If you have kids at home, involve them in such activities. They will greatly enjoy doing it. So once we are done molding, we let it cool down completely and harden up. And our coconut candies are ready. So the more sugar you add, the harder it becomes when it cools down. Guys, make this for your children and I assure you, they will really love them. You can easily store them in airtight containers and they can last for months. Thank you so much for watching. Stay blessed. Bye-bye.